it's not just me that's on call, it's my whole family's on call and they have been now for uh, 12 years. So, uh, and I've got a six year old and a four year old and that's all they know. They know that dad go, comes comes home from work and often is home for, from work for half an hour and then is back out again for three or four hours and we don't get to put them to bed and we don't get to uh, read them the books and we get, don't get to do those sort of special things that just the normal father does in a lot of cases. So your days off become the, the real imperative time to become a parent. Well, probably it's just not, not me that's angry, it's my family that's angry, it's my wife that's, she's just, you know, so disappointed that once again we're, we've set ourselves up in this beautiful town, we love the town, we're, we're very involved in the community and it just cuts back the ability for either of us to be able to uh, sort of get, or participate in the town and, and I suppose make the community a better place, that's what we do. We all know that um, eight hours of, uh, of, of time uh, not sleeping is, is equivalent to um, 0.05 in terms of blood alcohol levels when we're driving. We do a lot of a lot of long distance transfers down to Newcastle and Maitland. And I fear that um, you know, as a result of this, this could actually become quite a dangerous roster uh, and for the welfare of ambulance officers and patients.